You don't see. Nobody's just driving around for fun anymore. No, no <laughs> Sunday drives. No. No, not with gas prices like this. They keep going up and up and up. No matter where you look, uh, we're getting closer and closer to six bucks. The, the state average, according Four to AAA. Or seven, James, depending on uh, where you fill yeah, up. Yeah, diesel. Uh, right around 572 is the statewide average, but here in the Bay Area, of course. Much closer to six dollars yes. here, and a lot of people might want to go somewhere for the weekend. What are they going to do? Crown Force Sarah Stinson is live in Contra Costa County with some ideas. Hi, Sarah. Daria James, people have been watching gas prices climb all week, and we're here at Friday. They've gone up 65 cents on average in the Bay Area. Look at this. If you have cash, you're luck in luck. $5.99. If you have card, $6.09. So you better have that cash handy. Then you head down to plus. It just keeps going up. $6.29. And forget about diesel. I mean, if you're a diesel and you work in like construction or you have a truck, $6.99. Just under $7. People commuting said this is extremely frustrating. They're actually shopping around. Take a look at the average prices in the Bay Area. We'll show you where it's most expensive since people are shopping around before they head out the door. You can see the most expensive gas price is in San Francisco, and that is at $5.86 today. Last week, it was $5.21. Now, the most expensive in the whole Bay Area is San Rafael. We've seen that throughout the week, $5.93 compared to last week, $5.25. It's crazy because the Bay Area average at $0.65 cents more this week compared to last week is also the average in California. Usually the Bay Area is a little higher than that, but that goes to show you that these gas prices are soaring across the state. So you can see the cheapest on your screen is in San Jose. Now this morning we've been in Orinda, now we're in Lafayette. We talked to a man who was heading to work. He said that this is so hard for his family, paying for his car, his wife's car, and the kids. That is a $400 uh, bill right there, and he has to fill up his car every two days. Talk to another woman. She's driving driving from Walnut Creek to San Francisco for work. She usually takes public transit, but she was running late and she stopped here in Lafayette to try and get the best deal. I've been taking BART and Underground Mini. So uh, the prices of gas is just ridiculous. Imagine me, I have to fill up because I don't have an electric car or a hybrid. So I'm filling my car up two times a week, maybe three, depending, and I'm going deep into San Francisco. She was telling me just how frustrating it is. She said it's truly unaffordable, and that's why she does try and take public transit. But when you're in a crunch, you just got to drive and bite the bullet and pay these high prices. Now, will this affect people's plans for the weekends? Well, so far, what we've heard is yes. If you didn't tune in last hour, one man told us that it's a permanent staycation from here. He's staying home prices are just too high james daria back to you all right we're getting the crown for a carpool together sarah <laughs> so, yeah let's get in there let's <laughs> we'll head to tahoe yeah we'll swing by your house uh it's it's tough everybody's trying to figure out the best way to do it 634 is the time thank you very much